you live. Okay. Hi, Letitia. How are you? Good, Chris. I'm sitting in a 37 degree day in Sydney. How are you going? <laughs> uh, 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 I'm not interested. We're, we're on the edge of Commonwealth Bay here. With, it's a, got a 50 kilometre hour wind. We're sitting at about minus 50 degrees in Winchell. Uh, it's absolutely. We're in the home of the blizzard for sure this time. It looks crazy out there. Well, it is. We're just on the edge of a sea ice, just behind me. You might even see out some black dots and see Adelie penguins just round here. We, we've had an amazing time over these last few days since we last uh, spoke. We did a hangout just a couple of days ago. I know we couldn't hook up, but we managed to get to hold of horses hut at Cape Denison, which was fantastic. And how's the hut looking? Is it in good condition? Oh, it, it, it was looking incredible. I know you have some film footage of uh, the actual interior and so you can get a view of uh, what the inside looks like. But it took us about three hours to dig in through the door. And my gosh, it, I wish you could have been there. It was an incredible time capsule. And there's books left on the sides, there's cups and oh, there's even potatoes. <laughs> it's, it's an amazing spot. You, you just feel like they've left the room. It's absolutely very humbling to be there. That's amazing. And and wh whereabouts are you now? Like, what's happening there? Well, we were very fortunate. We, we had to strike out and pioneer a new route through the uh, jumbled ice mass on the sea ice. So we um, we got there. It took us about four hours each way. And uh, we eventually got to the hut. And uh, the weather was really good. In fact, it was still calm. So we managed to get a second group in. But we knew this bad weather was coming in. So we basically had to uh, swing round and move the ship out. So we couldn't get everyone into Morrison's hut, unfortunately. But what we did do is um, is actually come round to the eastern side of uh, Commonwealth Bay. And we're just near what's known as the Merz Glacier. And we're basically now being hammered by a, bl a blizzard. We've got snow, 50 kilometer hour winds. And uh, we're trying to do some science. We did a lot of great science at uh, Morrison's hut. And we've now relocated here to uh, get some of the guys on the content from another part of uh, Commonwealth Bay and also uh, get some science stuff up. We thought, although we couldn't broadcast to you live from the uh, water's hut, we're very much in the immediate area, we're only about 60 kilometres away. Uh, we're experiencing the delights of Cape Denison and that it's known for. High winds, we're enjoying them. I mean, that's, yeah, yeah, we are. <laughs> And so what I thought was, uh, we've got two volunteers here, Andrew, who's uh, the expedition doctor, and Paul Vick, who's uh, one of the expedition members. Um, I'll just introduce you. I'll go ahead and shot. So drifting over, there's Andrew in the uh, orange jacket. And here's Paul Vick, dressed in heroic era gear. <laughs> <laughs> and Andrew, in this sort of extreme cold, how are people holding up? Looks like we may have lost them, folks. We'll just hold on and see if they'll... 50 kilometre winds must be wreaking havoc with their systems. <laughs> 